Well, Jim Thorpe's held on to the flag and medals at his home in Roy for nearly a year, and he hopes now is his final chance to get them back to the soldier's family that they belong to. Thomas D. Walker. A World War II hero, soldier in the Pacific Theater, honored for his conduct in the military and heroism in battle. He was obviously someone special that did something to earn those medals. Among them, a purple heart and bronze star engraved with his name and a picture of a helmeted young man holding a mortar with a warning on the back. It says, Douglas, would you please, please send back, have just the one. I just, I feel it belongs with the family. Jim Thorpe never knew Thomas Walker. He doesn't know where he lived or even which branch of the military he served, but in his possession, symbols of the soldier's character and courage. I can't imagine this isn't missed. Somebody, somebody knows this is missing. It was found dirty, forgotten in the back of a closet of a 31st Street Ogden apartment. Thorpe's friend discovered it and gave it to him last summer. The grandson of two World War II veterans contacted the U.S. military and searched online for the veteran's family. Honestly, I, I figured somebody would claim it right away. I didn't think that I'd be holding on to him for so long. The common name of Thomas Walker, overwhelming among 16 million American soldiers. In the middle of cancer treatment himself, Thorpe's found two possible connections, one in Oregon and another in Illinois. While nothing's concrete yet, Thorpe's not giving up. I would love to know more about him. He's kind of been with me for a minute, you know, but I'd like to get him back to his family. That's the ultimate goal. And if you have any information about Thomas D. Walker, you can get a hold of Thorpe and his daughter on our website, fox13now.com. Reporting in Roy, Haley Higgins, Fox 13 News, Utah.